Hey guys, it's Allison and welcome back. First of all, I apologize that I sound like I'm dying. I think I'm sick like yesterday and today and my throat has really hurt and I'm just not feeling well so I'm sorry if I sound like I'm dying. I wasn't originally going to film anything today because of the issues with my throat and my voice but unfortunately I have to film this. So like I said, I'm not feeling well so I just was kind of laying in bed and well on my mattress after my room flooded. But I uploaded the teacher's pet video today and the Haley May video today because those are all videos that I filmed a while ago and I was just uploading them today because that's the upload schedule of the series. But guys, I have unfortunately gotten a community guidelines warning and that's really bad. It's not a strike, but if I get another warning for something stupid or a mistake, I'm gonna get a strike. And if I get another warning, I won't be able to upload for a week. So, yeah, let me tell y'all what happened. So, like I said, I uploaded the Teacher's Pet episode of K-12 through today, and, of course, you guys all know what that song is about, which is, you know, <laughs> pedophilia between a teacher and a student. And I had this edit planned for a while now of doing that song where it's like, uh-oh, that sounds like pet 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 like, you know what I'm talking about. It was a joke. It's funny. Well, I don't know. Maybe it's not that funny. But I wanted to do the edit. So, yeah. So I did the edit today because I'm like, that's not hard on my voice. I don't even have to say anything. I just had to edit. And I uploaded it a few hours ago. And this is what I have now. So my video got blocked for terms and policies. And I freaked out. And I was like, what? Why? I've seen so many other people do this edit and talk about other disturbing things on YouTube and other stuff like guys this is the kind of thing you get if you upload like literal porn or killing or murdering like how was my lps edit the same thing well i think i know why because it had pedophilia in the title and youtube probably thinks that i'm doing something bad to sexualize minors and even though i'm 18 and i'm basically like an eight year old technically I film with toys, so they're probably thinking now that my channel is some creepy thing that lures in kids while I play with toys and talk about pedophilic things. Great. And in the title, if I ever have swear words in a title of a video, I always start it out. And I also start out potentially triggering things. And I meant to start out the word pedophilia, but since I'm sick and tired, I wasn't paying attention and I wrote the word completely. And, well this is what we have because that's clearly the only reason they didn't even watch it because if you watch it it's just LPS with text over top of it there is nothing like inappropriate about the actual video I mean obviously the subjects inappropriate but there was nothing really bad in the video except a quick like six oh seven seconds sorry like community guidelines strike like can you give me a break like i did not upload a dead body hanging in the woods like jeez also no hate to logan paul he's cool i know that was just a very stupid decision that he made years ago but still this other stuff on youtube that people post that they should not be getting away with meanwhile i got my video taken down i want to re-upload it and change the title and see if that fixes anything because the actual content I don't think is the problem it's the title because I didn't delete it yet but I don't know what to do so yeah guys this is this is fun oh yeah I just I just make the most inappropriate content you know all those LPS porn videos I make oh wait no I don't remember that either like I'm scared because if I get into like another stupid mistake I don't want to start anything like jeez Anyway, so then I opened my phone to this. Your content was removed due to a violation of our community guidelines. Because it's the first time, this is just a warning. If it happens again, your channel will get a strike and you won't be able to do things like upload, post, or live stream for one week. I mean, I guess it's nice that they're giving me a warning, but like, jeez, like, I am not a bad, and I, I make bad videos, like, they suck, but I don't make, like, bad, bad, evil, cruel content. Like, oh my gosh. Sorry, I'm already in a bad mood because I'm sick, but like this is just making me more upset. Anyway, so then I go to YouTube Studio and I see this community guidelines warning your content, LPS, that sounds like pedophilia, K-12, edit was removed. Thanks. Here's what we found. Child safety. Ch wow. We have zero tolerance for predatory behavior on YouTube. Content that sexualizes minors in any way is not allowed on YouTube. 
You know, I might have to hold your hand when I tell you guys this, but um, LPS unfortunately aren't real. They're toys and they're not real children. Like, I understand that some bot probably thinks that they're like real people, but they're not. So how this impacts you, community guidelines warning, I'm shaking. Anyway, how this impacts you, because this is your first time, it's just a warning, basically telling you that I suck, and this content can be viewed on YouTube and can't earn money. And then what's next? You can take a policy training to have this warning expire in 90 days. If you think we made a mistake, you can appeal our decision. Now, I'm not going to fight to get the video back because I can just re-upload it and change the title because the title is clearly the reason why. But I'm not going to appeal it and try and fight for it back because I just don't feel like doing that. I might have to do this policy training thing, but wow. I can't believe this. Also, my mom has access to like all the YouTube emails, so she's going to see that come up and think I'm actually posting like LPS porn. So this is going to be a really awkward conversation. She's going to be like, why would you do that? <sighs> I know lately I've made a bit more mature content, but that's just because I've been sad without school and I haven't had much to do. So I'm just kind of letting my imagination run wild. But yeah, now guys, I have no clue what I want to do. Because I'm pretty sure if I start out the title, <coughs> that things would have been fine. And now I'm really worried like the FBI or the police are actually going to show up and think that I'm making like sexualized content with children. Like... That is not what I'm doing, like, guys, I'm asexual, I hate this kind of thing. Actually, no matter what your sexuality is, you should not like pedophilia in any way. But I'm just saying, I'm normally innocent when it comes to my content, and I feel like this is a bit too far. I, I know it was stupid of me to change, I shouldn't have put that as the title, but I'm sick and I wasn't paying attention, and that was stupid of me. Well guys, I have screwed up, and lesson of the day is do not be an idiot like me and make any kind of suggestive or horrible YouTube titles. Make sure you watch what you're typing. If you intend to censor or star something out, please do that. Um, I feel really stupid, and I don't know. I probably will re-upload the video eventually, but with a different title, and yeah. So I just want to share my experience of getting a community guidelines warning. I believe that my title was bad, but I don't think that I deserved, like, getting a warning saying that I'm sexualizing minors because I'm definitely not, but I understand how they interpreted that, so, yeah, I just feel really stupid, but, yeah, guys, I'm sorry, I'm sick, and this just sucks, so, thank you for watching, sure to like, subscribe, comment if you can, and we'll see you later, bye.